it's, it's like a delicacy. It's, it's, it's unique. Um, yes, it, it might smell like the gentry rhinos or whatever, but uh, that, that's part of the fun of it, I suppose. I don't know. Um, it's, it's a lovely, it's a lovely dish. I mean, so many of our regulars just ask for it all the time. People crave, they say, get me a little from home, just get me a teeny weeny bit. And I say, I can't do it because my wife won't allow me to in the first place. It's got an element in it that makes people, you know, crave for it. Which is why in England, outside of India perhaps, it became the biggest uh, consumer of Bombay duck. This is not for sale. I know it's not for sale. It's not how it comes up, is it? Well, I think a lot of the European things are loaded with rubbish anyway. I mean, the overrated and too strict, but um, I've never had a problem with it. I, I used to eat it, it used to smell a lot, it wasn't, it wasn't, like, it wasn't um, socially acceptable, but the taste is fine and I don't see why it should be banned. It's banned for no apparent reason. They don't even know why they're banned, they don't even know the product they've banned. That's the problem with it. It's there. Down the hatch. <laughs> 